Good morning! So it's another day in paradise. Today we're doing a little bit of shopping. We're going to the Westfield Centre. There's two of them I think and it's the Manic West one. I'm wearing a wee pink dress. I'm not sure if you could tell that I like pink today. Um, I've got this wee bandana in as well. Uh, so yeah, that is the plan. I'll take you along with me. It's not going to be a very detailed vlog today. It's just going to be some shopping. Um, as I said, so and I think we're going to eat in the flat tonight, so nothing too exciting there. But I'm going to show you the shopping mall and then I'll end the vlog today and then we'll start a new one tomorrow. We've got lots of exciting things to do tomorrow, so I'll see you there. There it is Westfield. We just got the L1 and we got off at San Andre. San Andre? San Andre? And here it is. We were just saying that like everyone here has the basketball aesthetic. Like everyone wears basketball t-shirts with like different clothes, sneakers, like sneakers, trainers. Like it's just such a basketball aesthetic, isn't it? Like baggy shorts, like so many people. It looks so cool, but I feel like in the UK if you wore that, it would be like a wee bit strange. Not strange, but like unique kind of. Like you don't see it often. But here, like, everybody basketball has a basketball aesthetic. So we're nearly there. We kids playing basketball up there, funnily enough. So this shopping centre has been fa is famous for being the smallest shopping centre in Barcelona. So that's why we've come here to see, to see it. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Kidding, it's the biggest. <laughs> it's actually yeah, it's the biggest. I, not to believe you, I, I kept saying it. to Scott, oh, it's just a wee bit small, there's only five shops here. <laughs> huge. Yeah, that was a lie, there's about 500. <laughs> Crossing the road here is quite different to in the UK, because in the UK you obviously press a button, but here it just ever, like, every so often just turns to green and you just walk, but then the cars still go across, so I don't really understand it, but I think they're just a bit of reckless drivers. I like going the Okay. Yay, Scott's happy. I said to him, do you want to go on a beach day, do you want to go shopping, or do you want to do like touristy things again? And he opted for shopping, which I think we needed because he was not well this morning. And um, it's nice and cold in shops, which is great. So that's exactly what we're doing. Scott wants to go in here. Ooh, we need to go in Zara. Look at all the shops that they have. to order because none of us have been to Dunkin Donuts before so it was a wee bit confusing obviously it was in Spanish but the girl was helpful so we managed to get what we ordered. Scott got this donut. Oh it's all stuck. Mm. He got that one and I got a big fat chocolate muffin mm. and then I got this fruity frozen drink and Scott got like an Oreo one. Let's do a taste test. Have you tried yours already? Then I have a strawberry one, so we're going with the berries. Let's see. That's nice. I could get on board with that one. So that's called Colata Frutos Rojo. Nice. Tastes like when an ice pole's melted. Mmm. Love that. Smell. Smell better. Say cheese. Sorry, I'm trying to get the right angle. Comes in and then I can see you on the thing. Say cheese. <laughs> um. So we've acquired a bag of goodies. It looks like a very messy bag of goodies, but. We actually just shoved it all in there, but I've bought a bunch of stuff. So Scott, so we'll do a wee hot. Oh, babe! <laughs> do 
Bara det var euro. Toppen det bara det är bara. Look at these t-shirts. Oh. This is very... Sorry, we're back to business. Um, this place is crazy. I mean, it's literally just like a supermarket you get in the UK, but it's just so different. <gasps> we are having some amount of shit luck, I swear to God, I just started... We're just in the supermarket though and I was just going to say like it's so fun seeing all the different stuff that there is. Um, we'll do yeah, we haul when we get home but I'm going to start filming just now because it's obviously bad luck just now so I'll see you soon. This is all crisps. So many different kinds of crisps. Look at this nice wee food court as well. So nice. Just gonna video this center for you. So that's all the shops in there. Then up the top, but you've got a cinema over there, and then all of these food places. You can't see over there, but all these food places. So here is all the stuff that we got. I'm gonna show you what I got that's like not food shopping, and then me and Scott are gonna do a wee taste test video, which is not gonna be part of this one, um, of some Spanish food that we find in the supermarket from this carry four. Hey hey, so I'm just gonna quickly show you some of the bits that we got. It's nothing exciting this part to be honest, Scott's got the best part. So the first shop we went to was called Primore, I think. Sounds like Primark but it wasn't, it was a beauty place. I needed a brow pencil so I went in there. I also got this powder, which is translucent loose powder and I needed this. As you can tell I'm a sweaty boy. So I needed some powder, that's gonna come with me every day. Scott's watching the football there by the way, that's why his silhouette is there. Um, I also got this Planet Fruit Mango Scented Spray, it's just a wee one but I needed to freshen up. Next I got this nail polish and of course it's pink. The green wasn't really working, it needed to be pink obviously. No, I'm kidding. I actually do have quite a lot of these nail polishes already, but I don't think you can ever have too much pink, so... Well, your Scott was really wanting to wear it, so I said, right, I'll get you it, don't worry. Um, then we went into this place called AliExpress, and I've seen that online before, but I never knew they actually had places that you could go into. And I got this, <laughs> I got this thing called Fuming Mum, and you put it in the microwave, and it's supposed to clean your microwave, but I thought it was really funny. I thought I'll get that from my mum, because she is a fuming cleaner. It's shaped like a wee mum as well. So I thought I'd get that for her. Also in that shop I got this little pink hair clip. I just thought that was a really nice colour and it was very cute. So I got that. And then also in AliExpress I got these. Shaped like a unicorn. Yeah, I got these little bracelets like a wee chain. It's got a string in it, it's got letters in it. I thought me and Scott could make wee bracelets for each other. <laughs> so that's the plan behind that one. And then we went to a couple other shops where Scott got stuff but I didn't. Then we went to Carry 4 which is where we got the food for that we're going to do the food tasting of. But um, also we just picked up some, some boring bits. I got hairspray, Scott got a shampoo. And I also got these wee bikini bottoms. There's kind of a running theme here that I like pink. I don't know if you could tell. Cute. And then also got some makeup wipes, some biodegradable ones. Also got some face masks for anyone who comes here and has maybe forgotten. Also some paper straws for drinks. And that is pretty much all that I got, but I'm going to show you what Scott got. So first of all, we went into, we were going around Bershka and Pull and Bear. They're really good shops. We're loving the basketball aesthetic, so we were thinking we'll get some basketball kind of themed stuff. And also just some graphic tees. Um, and I was like to Scott, right, you're not getting any more black ones. And alas, there's black ones in here, but hey ho. So this was in Pull and Bear, I think, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. I mean, this is kind of mad doing, but also he liked it, so. This one. Nice. Love this stone colour at the minute. And it says, the M Metropolitan Museum of Art. Might be borrowing some of Scott's new t-shirts sometime. A chain. 
to go a wee bit of extra jewellery to wear and maybe hopefully it will suit me. I normally don't but maybe I will. Everybody here is wearing chains, that's something we notice as well and it looks really nice. And then I'm going to show these three things please, if you don't mind. Mm -hmm. Because then we went to this shop called Cities and oh my god. It was our favourite shop, well certainly mine out of the whole it place. Was mine. Okay. So basically it was all these like really clever t-shirts and it was three for 30 euros so it was only 10 euros a t-shirt. This one was my favourite one. I see, actually seen someone wearing this the other day and I was like, ah! Because I love this Disney character. Na -na. Stitch in a coffee cup. Yeah. So that one is super cute. I love that one so much. Actually I love these ones as well to be honest. An astronaut painting a smiley face on the moon. Look like how cool favorite. I'd look in that though. Definitely my favourite one though. Who wore it better? Me obviously. You need to vote in the comments. <laughs> and this one as well, another black one but I like this one a lot as well. So it's basically the mountains with the sun and the sun is dripping. Different colours. Oh my god, I really suit the skater girl aesthetic. If I do say so myself. Don't you think? You can see me with my skateboard like. Can you do that so, when you're when you're Yeah, this is how you walk. Swag. <laughs> Swag, who says that? Love that place. Cities. I don't know where you can go there else in the world, but or if they're online or whatever, but would recommend having a look if you're you can. Try and see if they're online, but those like are really, them. really cool. And also a ten or t shirts and the quality is really nice, isn't it? really good quality like all the t-shirts were so cool there was a where's wally one and it was like it was a where's wally sitting doing yoga and he was like um Find find yourself, yourself. i thought that was so funny like they were dead clever all the t-shirts ones and pokemon ones and yeah and stranger things ones and there was one that had a crocodile down it said low cost instead of low cost they were, really good. they were all really good they were all really really good so yeah that's everything that we got in terms of the actual items and not food so we're going to do a little video now on the taste test and some food that we got it's basically just crisps sweets and a juice pretty much yeah. so that's the plan that's my catchphrase i think that's the plan i've said that in every single video thank you very much for watching and we'll see you in the next one